Hey guys, and here's another tutorial on Blender, and this is going to be a real quick one. We're just going to be looking at how we can make a circle indentation inside of a square cube or a flat face. So it's uh, something that you might quite often want to do. You want to have a circular indentation here, and you want to keep our geometry nice and clean. So jump over into edit mode. I'm going to select this face. So we're going to make a hole inside of this face here. So we're in the face edit mode. Select that face, I'm going to subdivide it a few times. Okay, and then I want to get approximately kind of a top view on it. We're going to select, circle select, or hotkey C. You can scale that circle up and down. We'll select something about this big. I want to make sure that we've got a nice circle-ish selection there that's kind of even. That's good. Hit escape. So now we've got our selection. You come down to mesh, transform, to sphere. And you'll see now as you drag your mouse around, it kind of shrinks in those vertices together and will create a circular shape. So the more you drag it out, the smoother our circle will be. So we want it to be relatively smooth because uh, I'm not I'm not adding smoothing to this shape right now. So we'll drag it out. But you see it bunches up all the vertices. It makes it a bit of a mess, but we'll sort that out later. So we get that smoothish. There we go. So there's our circle in our cube. Now we can hit E to extrude, drag it downwards, and there is our circle. Now you can see our vertices around the bottom there are quite a mess. That would be really horrible. Um, very bad geometry. So we'll, we come down to our mesh. And um, it's under cleanup. And we go to limited dissolve. And after you do that, you'll see here now, it dissolves away those unnecessary vertices. And just gives us a nice ring of vertices around the inside of our shape there now. Still maybe a little bit of cleaning up you could do like these here. Maybe those are loose, so you could go it depends on how anal you are about keeping your mesh tidy, but you merge at last there. So you can get rid of these. Whatever you want to do just to clean it up, but that basically is how we uh put a circle, a circular hole, into a square face using Blender. So I hope this tutorial is of some use to you and uh, answered your question. Thanks for tuning in and I'll see you next time.